Welcome to our Laravel tutorial. Today, we're tackling a question that many developers encounter when working with Excel files. Our viewer is using the Laravel Excel library to read an Excel file, but they're running into a frustrating error. Let's dive into the details and find out how to resolve this issue together. Welcome back to another tech video. Today we're going to be going through your question, answering it, and hopefully finding that solution for you. Guys, remember to stay a little bit crazy like me and find that resolution. Now, let's continue on. To read an Excel file in Laravel using the Laravel Excel library, we first need to ensure that the file path is correctly specified. The error you're encountering indicates that the library is trying to access a URL instead of a local file path. Instead of using the URL to the file, you should provide the local file path. In your case, the file is located in the Assets panel slash cell directory of your Laravel project. Let's modify your code to use the local file path. Replace the URL with the actual path to the file on your server. Here's how you can do it. By using the public path function, Laravel will correctly resolve the path to your Excel file. This should eliminate the error and allow you to read the file successfully. Finally, make sure that the file permissions are set correctly so that your application can read the file. If you still encounter issues, check the file's existence and permissions. Let's now look at a user-suggested answer. To read an XLS file in Laravel using Laravel Excel, you can create a route in your WebPHP file. First, specify the path to your Excel file. Alternatively, you can use the public path helper function to specify the file path more dynamically. Keep in mind that the PHP Excel library checks if the file exists using the file exists function, which only works for local paths, not remote URLs. And that's it. I hope that that's helped find the solution that you're looking for. And if it did, please, I'd appreciate it if you hit the subscribe button. Every time you hit it, it really helps. Now, I'll see you next time. Next time you need some technical help. And until then, have a good one.